Can right? you show us what the glue dots look like? Yes, yes, yes. For the folks that, like myself, I'm yeah, not Yeah, and I'm gonna actually, familiar. we're gonna do this and we're gonna use them for just okay. a second here too. Can we see the packaging? These are the lined ones, which I like, right there. Okay. See that? Okay. So you can like, okay. take one. And let's do our cool. Yeah, because I am not familiar with this stuff. Let's do our fun milk bottles. These antique milk bottles, I got these at an auction. How cool are those? That sounds awesome. Pretty cool. Okay, I'm gonna eyeball this again. Okay, so then I take my glue line. Get it oh, on I there. See. Okay. And then you peel off your plastic. So then you have glue line on the glass. See that? Gotcha. Okay, so just in the interest of time, I'm just gonna do one on each milk bottle. Normally I would put, like, I would cover that rim with okay. glue dots. Just because it's better, it's always better safe than sorry, right? Yeah, for sure. Always, always, always. You never want to have somebody's cake fall. So basically them. you just press down and then you peel it off and leave the glue behind. Yes. Gotcha. This one's got an extra one here. Yeah, because if, see, if you try to do it by yourself, see, yeah. I'm like all stuck to it and it's not really working out very well. Okay, yeah. so if you leave the plastic on and, and I mean, I'm kind of bending it. You see how I'm kind of bending it with the plastic on there? Yeah. Right? Squish it down really good. And once again, I bet practice would come in handy here. Yeah, it's a little Just bit of trial and error. Do it, yeah, do it a few times and a get used bit. to glue dots. Yeah, these are great. Interesting. Well, these things have saved my tail on TV shows, let me tell you that. Yeah. Oh my goodness. But again, even if you're going on TV, you're doing a thing, it wouldn't want to be your first time you've ever done it. You're going, no, no, I know what glue dots are all about. No. That's what I love practice. Very cool. And those are great little milk bottles. Those are very cool looking. Fun. They just look and, great. I mean, I could put like some, some leaves in there. I could put some fake yeah. milk in there. Yeah. Okay, so here's your piece of glass. And you got this glass at Walmart? Yeah. Just your basic. Now, I will be honest Walmart. with you. When I got it, I had not tested it with the weight of that cake. Okay. This cake was really heavy. Yeah. And it was rather large. Um, and as I'm carrying it underneath here down to the lake tent and stuff, I was like, because that's pretty thin. I was like, Please don't break, please don't Because I just had like visions in my head of like this cracking glass right. and cake falling everywhere. Yep. You know, I can't be the only one that has cake nightmares. <laughs> I'm sure nope. everybody has cake nightmares. Oh yeah. Um, okay, so, so I don't hurt my bottles, but see how this is even gonna like lift all oh, my yeah. bottles up? Okay. Yeah. I don't wanna hurt the countertop either. Okay, but see, now this is really strong. Yeah. Okay, so now you put your cake on there. I would hold all kinds of styrofoam. And, oh, yeah. I mean, I can... Now, granted, this yeah. being heavy would help, too, but, I mean, I can push down pretty hard on this and not move it. Yeah. I'm afraid I break the glass. Um, okay, so does that make sense? Yep. Yeah? Okay. 